Beach Row tried to flick that one around the corner. Rio Hardy can benefit from it. Hardy didn't acknowledge the space. Brogan Hay was in as Patrick Thistle looked to benefit down this left side with Donaldson. Plays it to the edge of the area. A chance for Longcake. Rides one challenge. Chance for Longcake to shoot across goal. Blocked on the line by Liv McLaughlin. Rio Hardy didn't acknowledge the pass of Brogan Hay on the far side. She was in so much space and Patrick Thistle managed to benefit from it and almost took the lead through the striker but for some good defensive work by Liv McLaughlin on the line. He died so versatile on this Rangers side. Played in midfield for so many years but I mean stay at the heart of defence now is the long ball from Cathy Hill. Looks to seek out Mia McCauley. It's going to be a chance for the youngster and a goal for Mia McCauley to open the scoring in the Sky Sports Cup final for Rangers. Long ball over the top from Cathy Hill. There was so much space for the youngster. And with the goal gaping, she finished it off well. Continues a fantastic run of form this season. And there's not many more in this Rangers side who deserve a goal in a cup final for the showing so far. Mia McCauley gives Rangers the lead in the capital. It's Rangers 1, Partick Thistle nil. Here is McCauley, looks for a ball down the line towards Jane Ross, wants a foul as well. As Partick Thistle change over the ball, here comes Claire Doherty inside. It's going to be a strike, it's a decent one, it's a goal. As Partick Thistle get themselves back on level terms. A fantastic strike from the edge of the area. from Rachel Donaldson to get themselves back on level terms in the contest picked the ball up picked a spot and fired it beyond Victoria Essen 1-1 one, one, game on in the capital <laughs> Cathy Hill Logan Heat it down the line looking for the run of Jane Ross who's timed it well good tackle over there again though by Claire Doherty Cathy Hill runs it back for Rangers back towards Jane Ross in that corner flag spins and delivers across into the area Rio Hardy jump McCauley made it as well just wide of the post probably came at her by surprise with Hardy's initial effort turning into more of a flick on than a shot Landed at the head of McCauley. He was unable to turn it into the back of the net. Half chance though for Rangers at the far post there. And great chances from nothing. Connor taking short. What now towards Rachel Rowe inside the area. Rowe to shoot. What a finish that is from Rachel Rowe. Cuts inside. Smashes it towards goal and off the bar and into the back of the net for Rangers as they regain the lead at Tyne Castle. It was a clever corner kick routine initially taken by the Wales International. Rogan Hay was the one that found her and what a strike it was from such a tight angle as well. Off the bundle side of the bar as Rangers are back in front. Oh, McLaughlin, good pass into the feet of Rio Hardy who's spun away and finds Jane Ross. Good combination play. It's going to be a chance for Rio Hardy inside the box. And a third goal for Rangers. Rio Hardy, Rangers top goal scorer this season. Adds to our goal tally to add a third of the afternoon before the break and puts them in such a commanding position going into the half-time interval. Really good play from the striker, rushed through on goal 
and finished it beyond these then to give Rangers breathing space in the final. So it remains over that far side. We'll switch to the left flank towards the end of the first half. Remains over there for the second as Hugh Hardy chased that long ball down. Potentially might break for the striker and does. But her effort flashes past the post with the goal gaping. Goalkeeper and defender felt there was a foul in there. Real Hardy benefited, benefited from that. But was unable to turn the chance into a goal. With the goal at her mercy. At the angle. Or Partick Tissell driving down the left flank. Good defending in there by Cathy Hill. Who sends it forward towards Rachel Rowe. To the feet of Mia McCauley. Back inside for Rachel Rowe. She brings the ball forward and slips it through, looking for Jane Ross. Jane Ross is in behind for Rangers, it's shot, it's saved initially, broken here in the rebound, chance for Liv McLaughlin. And Rangers add a fourth on the day. It's Liv McLaughlin in her first cup final as a player. The Aston Villa Loney turns that one in. Looked like Jade Ross was going to be the one to put it away for Rangers. Good save initially. Brogan Hay was there to latch on to the rebound. Cut it back. And Liv McLaughlin fires it into the goal. As Rangers make it four. And take now to Midak. Roll round the corner. Libby Bans. Cuts one towards Howitt. Christy Howitt can bring that one in. Lord McLaughlin. Shot from Lizzie Arnett. And round the post. Almost replicated that wonder goal at that end. And got ourselves on the score sheet today. But a good save from Easton. As we learn of four additional minutes at the end of the match. Which roll goes across. To take. Brogan Hayes delivery. Dag was close, so was Austin. It's going to be Nick Dock to shoot. What a strike that was from the Scotland International. What a way to round off this fantastic afternoon that would have been. Fantastic effort from the skipper. Comes off on the wrong side of the post. Caught it well. 